Who would have thought that washing dirty clothes in cold water could get them not only clean, but save money, too? Well, the DeKalb County Jail figured it out. We got this new sophisticated piece of equipment called some type of ozone generator. And somehow uh, our facility maintenance group working with Johnson Control has come up with this piece of equipment that will convert oxygen to ozone gas. Ozone is oxygen, O2, but with an extra molecule of oxygen, thus forming O3. And it's very effective in sanitizing and disinfecting, even in cold water. In fact, it kills bacteria just as well as chlorine. The ozone gas will go into the washing machine. We use less detergent, no hot water, and we have clean clothes, and it meets all of our disinfectant requirements that we're required to have in this large jail. Ozone cannot be stored, so it must be generated on site with an ozone generator. And the ozone generator is the machine that produces the ozone gas, which is then taken and distributed through these piping systems to provide the ozone gas into our laundry and washing machines. The ozone gas actually acts as an oxidant, where it oxidizes the water to break up the bacteria and the, uh, any contaminants, the dirt, uh, in order to cleanse the clothes. It's an odor-free or an odorless type of product, so it doesn't leave any residual smell or um, film. Now, perhaps you're curious what the inmates think about the new wash. They're telling me that they notice a big difference in the softness of the fabric, and the smell of the fabric. This may be the first time you're hearing about the commercial use of ozone, but it's been around for more than two decades, and it has a number of uses. They've actually used it to revitalize some lakes and ponds that were traditionally dead and full of contaminants. The ozone project at the jail was completed in May this year, and it's already starting to pay off. We're using 1,000 pounds of clothing a day that we're washing here. So if we can save on a huge amount of, of heat that is required to uh, wash those clothes, that's a significant savings. When it's all said and done, at the end of the year, we're saving somewhere around $23,000 a year. The new laundry system is just one of dozens of ways the county is using new technology to save money. A couple of years ago, we did a comprehensive audit of about 163 of our buildings and I, to identify opportunities for reducing energy costs and uh, other operating costs. We do not have to go back and receive more money through our capital improvement budget process or our operating budgets uh, to be able to fund these projects. So, in other words, these the projects are self-funding through the savings that they produce. When used properly, ozone helps conserve our natural resources, too. Ozone laundry systems use less water than traditional washing. Ozone helps reduce greenhouse gas emissions by lowering the need for hot water. Detergents are more effective when combined with ozone, which means less chemicals are needed. Less chemicals helps extend the lifespan of linens, and it also means there's less wastewater. This new ozone laundry system is just another example of DeKalb County thinking outside of the box and being more effective and more efficient. Reporting from the laundry room at DeKalb County's jail, for DCTV, I'm Aviva Hoffman.